yes ready dictation start 5 second start based on our experience and understanding of global environment today that sustainable development at the national level cannot be pursued in isolation quality of life of the nations today as also in the future depends to very large extent on the policies and actions that a fellow nations of the world pursue against this background new partnership have to be established for conservation and sustainable development while ensuring equitable distribution of technology and social advancement promoting these partnership require making the most of the diverse bunch of knowledge skill and of assets belonging to a wide cross sections of nations and society when we analyze the nature of pollutants we find that both affluence and poverty contribute to their high levels the problem of industrialized and developed world stem from their high levels of economy activity and consumption the degeneration of forest and natural resources in the developing countries on the other hand can be attributed largely to a lack of resources and alternative source of energy and econ- income generation tackle these two distinct causes therefore need to be significantly different in the case of the rich and developed world the issue can be best handled by lying emissions norms limits on pollutants and by enforcing these norms and limitation however for the developing and underdeveloped world the best approach would be to put into place an incentive structure that would encourage conservation and discourage the saving savaging of nature without compromising economy development and rapid evolutions of poverty for the developing country we should make concreted efforts to facilitate and promote adoption of environment friendly techn- techniques of production and also undertake far greater measures to des- disseminate information about ill effects of polluting forces as part of international effort to contain the ill effects of environmental degradation and to encourage sustainable development nation have to put in place several ecological treaties like montreal protocol the framework convention on climate change although much attention seems to be focused on climate change on global warming ozone layer very little is being done to address the environmental problems facing poor society whether it is to be of cleaning drinking water or poor sanitary condition let me reiterate that if we committed to successful address the challenges of sustainable development and hence of environment conservation then it will require an international movement the like of which has never been seen it will require effective integration of efforts being made by the different players whether 
इट बी इंटरनेशनल ऑर्गेनाइजेशन नेशनल गवर्नमेंट और नॉन गवर्नमेंटल एज सच थैंक यू